Greetings, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Mike Emmerich, looking forward to a high-scoring contest tonight. Well, at least maybe for one team, Doc, because one team certainly has the ability to fill the net as well as any team in the entire league. Bacon Country's coaching staff has them playing a fast-paced, straight-ahead, offensive brand of hockey. In order to play this way, you have to know what you are doing with the puck before you get it. Let's look at the starting netminders. A win in his last game, so he gets the nod in this one. Jacob Markstrom, originally a Florida Panthers draft pick, treasured his first shutout because he waited through 129 games to get it. Swedish born and trained and poised for this start. Alexander Ovechkin, the most prolific goal scorer of his era. One of the fastest in history to 600 goals in his first dozen NHL seasons, 26 league honors and awards. One timer, stick to some. Cut that pass in his own end. Let's it go. Say. Amarillo's in the neutral zone along the way. A one timer. The glove like lightning. Hey, Ray, you've got a closer look than we do. What are you seeing that we're not? One of the keys to this contest is going to be who can attack the other defense with more speed. Both defenses can get into trouble when they get challenged by outside speed. Thanks very much, Ray. Saskatchewan's driving upwards. To the point it comes. Intercepted that one at an important place. Stash deep to Ovechkin. Laid on to Huberdo. Shoots one. Saved there. Wants the shelter of the corner here. Read that play in his own end. Great save. Price makes a smart play and holds for a faceoff. Down near the players is Ray Ferraro. Saskatchewan's been pretty good through the first part of the season, guys. I've really liked the way that they found different players to step up and fill the void. When somebody goes down or somebody's not playing well, they always seem to get a contribution from an unexpected source. That's the sign of a good team. Many thanks, Ray. Hammers it. He was great in the lane. Snow was glistening. Leads that charge into the zone. Intercepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. Oh, look at this. He's alone. Can they catch him? And the referee's whistle has stopped playing. A little over seven minutes play. Game still waiting for its first goal. Good setup off the win. It's dumped in. Terrific determination by Oduya. Oh, what a hit that one was. Hamilton's arrived at the rink in a bad mood. That didn't take him very long to get physically involved in a game that should be aggressive throughout. Solid work there by Hemsky. The Swamp Rabbits are carrying it up along the boards. And he dumps it in. Now it's directed to Benoit. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Here's a one-timer. He scores! Goal number one. It took a while, but what a great moment for him. They'll certainly have more energy. They've got the game's first score, and now they can play from in front. Yurko's come up strong here for his team, ending a scoreless game. There was a feeling out process until that first goal of the game. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? The Swamp Rabbits are looking to make a play out of their own zone. By number 61. On to Stoner. And they've got it again. Bacon Country's along the wing at center ice. Shot. Muscled right off. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. 
Trying to go to Dowell. Skates it into the zone. Looking from the corner. Shoots. Great save, point blank. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Just a little over six minutes to be played here in the first. Amarillo's up in this game, 1-0. Good job on the draw. Bacon Country's carrying it through center. Oh, broke it up. Using the point. And moved down to Huberdo. Slid to Carlson. Fires. Blocker save. He's got it there. He wants to clear it out. Skill play by Ovechkin. Loves it. Terrific shot, but a great point blank save. Petrie's skating ability gets him into position here to deliver a crushing hit. Solid clean win. Pitching it to Upshaw. Driving in from no man's land. He cut that one off in the defensive end. Outstanding save. A good stick there, so no complete pass. Shifts to the backhand and shoots. Recollected. Bacon Country's looking to head man up the wing. Fires a shot. He scores! video will reveal here that the goaltender was in excellent position. Sometimes the shot is just so perfect it's unstoppable. It's a face-off win. May not seem important in that territory, but they have possession. Directing that one to Setaguchi. Has it picked up? Bacon Country's on the move, hoping to wheel it up the wing. Great save. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. That's a solid face-off win. Shot, point blank save. His perfect positioning allowed him to shut down that chance. 20 minutes have been played. The red light flashed twice, both for the same team. Two to nothing. Don't throw any objects on or towards the playing surface at any time during the game. The throwing of any object is ground for immediate removal from this building. Bacon Country's insurance goal was scored late in the period. You see it once again as we go to break. Eddie, we're about to enter the second period here. What did you think of the opening period of our game? The Swamp Rabbits are trailing on the scoreboard because their time on attack was limited. They'll need to push the pace if they want to score more goals. And the middle frame has begun. Propelled to Huberdo. Shoots one. And a save. Looking to Panarin. Keeps it in the zone with that interception. Petrie's got to shovel it out of there. Wonderful work done near the blue line. In with it now. Scooped up by Petrie. Amarillo's built a lead on the fact that they've dominated puck possession. Their goaltender has had a very easy night in there. Hasn't had a lot of shots, but he stopped what he's had to. What a tremendous hit. Huberto's not shy to throw his body around here at any time. Chip to Pareko. Near the boards. Crosses that line. Oh, snaps the shot! Tipped away! A 
great wrist shot. And there's another. Amazing reflexes. Ran into the defense. He's lost it. Bacon Country's controlling play through center. Laid on to Camilleri. Points it. A point blast. That puck hit him on the way to the net. To the half wall. Elevates a pass to Camilleri. Shoots. Wonderful stop. Stop that between the pads and a whistle. Markstrom's ability to move side to side is on display here. Quick shot, better save. A little under eight minutes have been played. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. Clean win on the draw. Saskatchewan setting up an offense from the wing. Takes that pass. A rocket! Got his pad on a changing shot. Amarillo's winging it at neutral ice. Nice work by Oduya. Up the left side to Pouliot. Takes it to the corner. Right to the point. Two guys together with force. Big force. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Can start the attack going in the zone. The Swamp Rabbits lug the puck in their own end. Shoots. The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. Right along the line. Goes to the backhand. Didn't miss by much. We sometimes forget the speeds these guys are playing at, but accuracy is a key in creating chances. On to Panarin. Bacon countries recoiling in the defensive zone. Gets in and he'll look over his options. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Let's it go. Handled with the stick. Boom, they came together that time, didn't they? I don't think he's going to take that road again. He got crunched on the wall. Let's it go. Gathered up by Petrie. That puck is held, and the whistle stops play. Camilleri's not feeling too well right now after that big collision. For all you young hockey players out there, you cannot put yourself in that position. Good job. He scores! Ovechkin! This goal is the quickness of his release. It gives him the advantage on this play, and the puck gets past the goaltender in a hurry. Now the goaltender wants to be aggressive here, but this is just perfectly delivered. Amarillo's built a three-goal lead here late in the second period, and the advantage in shots is enormous, too. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Gains that offensive line. Took that away in his own zone. 17 minutes, 17 seconds. He's bought tickets for friends here tonight. He's one away from a milestone. It's on his stick up that left side. Feeds the point. Right in that catching glove. Good work. Ovechkin's among the highest goal scorers in the league. He does his damage from in close to the net. He'll power his way in looking for rebounds. He's got a real knack for where the loose puck is into the last minute of the second period. Gives it over to the point. Shoots, he scores! And that's four straight goals.
that's a big goal there for them to score. They can go into the locker room feeling pretty good about themselves. Amarillo's just continuing to hammer away on the shot board. Enormous, and the score is large. They win the draw and will now set up an attack. Great job with the neutralized interception. A shot! Oh, that was close. Two periods have been played. And so, as we think back through the first two, we think ahead toward the third. Are you looking to impress at your next group of men? Then rent out one of our luxury boxes with great views. Price had a hard period, and you can see an example here. He'll try to pull it back together, and so will we when we come back. 40 minutes down, at least 20 minutes to go. What are your thoughts so far? The Swamp Rabbits have to correct one thing, Doc, after the first 40 minutes of play. That's turnovers. They were way too careless with the puck in the first 40 minutes of play. If they can manage the puck a little bit better here in the third period, they're still in this game. Interesting action in the first two periods. I wonder what we'll get as this third period has begun. Slid to Pareko. And he gains the zone. He takes that point pass. Cut that pass in his own end. A long scorcher. Save. Holds on and gets that whistle. Quick work on the faceoff. Back and forth they go between the points. Moving it to Pareko. Intercepted pass. Pass attempt to Panarin. Right off the left wing, it comes on through right on his stick. Terrific interception. Pitching this one to Spalling. Oh, and he's hammered. Pareko's understanding his role, Doc, with that big hit. He hasn't had many of those here tonight. That might change the momentum in this game. Nicely received at the point. Bacon countries recoiling back in their own end. Long saucer to Camilleri. Slides it to the point. Takes that pass from the other point man. Looks to make a play. Saved there. Kicked away. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. I thought the second save was better. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie said no chance. That's an excellent save. Just over eight minutes off the clock. All of the scoring has come from one side. Four of them. They win the draw. Propelled to Dowell. Handled in the corner by Puglia. Puck is thrown to Oduya. Stick handling up the wing. From the outside. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Let's it go. Gets a blocker on it. Gets it back. Bacon Country split almost perfectly this evening. They've gotten a few bounces along the way, but you earn your breaks. They have to be thrilled with their performance here. It'll come free, but not without a lot of work. Passing one off now to Stewart. Brings it in for an attack. Good place to shoot from, and he does. And decides to just cover it up and get the whistle. It is the time of year that you look forward to. A long string of home games. No travel for a while. The home jerseys for a good long stretch. Another face-off win. 
a great day for him. That puck is loose. No luck getting through that time. Around through the corner. That one is pointed to him. Chip to Stoner. A great waffle board save. Bacon Country's leaving the defensive zone. Steps across that line. Let's it go. Great save. Nice work with that stick. Knocked it away. Snapping a pass to Huberdo. Closed off effectively and sealed. Swept on to Johnson. Dishes it back. Elevates a pass to Camilleri. They're getting ready to strike. To Camilleri. And he gets it back. Missed the net. Collected now. The Swamp Rabbits with a neutral zone possession along the way. Took it up the boards and holds. Very important steal for him. Doc, they're trying to force the play now. You're behind the times panic seeps into your game, and you're just trying to do everything you can to get back. Shoots, got in front of another one. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. Ovechkin's creativity has been on display most of the season as he has among the highest total points in the league. Good face-off victory there. Puck picked up here. Gives it to the point. That was one he'll get the number on. It's been a bumpy road for them all night long, but this is a big hit designed to maybe turn things around a little bit on a team that's had a bad night. Camilleri's skating ability allowed him to really put a lot of force in behind that big hit. Solid face-off win. Shutout positioning by Upshaw. The Swamp Rabbits are at the wing in neutral ice. Let's a shot fly and a save. Stewart skating out of his own end. Gains the zone. Moves it to the corner. Well, we are late in this contest, but when you see him, you call him. And that's what they've done here. Amarillo's got a minor for slashing. He's making like Paul Bunyan out there. That's a two-minute slash. They win it. Close in play. Bumped, loses. And this one goes into the books. The Swamp Rabbits will head for the dressing room, hoping that the next game brings about something better. The previous ones certainly did, but the streak is in. For a team that's seen so much success of late, you have to wonder what happened here tonight. So that is it for this one. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good night all.